Now that Dan understands the benefits of decentralization, he wonders if blockchains are truly secure. Blockchains use cryptography to protect users' funds, hence the term cryptocurrencies. When Dan sends a transaction, he signs it with his private key, creating a unique signature using elliptic curve cryptography. Nodes use his public key to verify his signature without needing his private key, proving he's authorized to spend tokens from his address. Elliptic curve cryptography is so secure that the chance of guessing Dan's private key is less than 1 in 10 to the power of 77, virtually impossible. Transactions are stored in blocks, and nodes verify that Dan has enough tokens. Also, transactions are stored in Merkle trees of hashes, making it simple to verify whether a particular transaction happened on a blockchain. These cryptographic mechanisms are built into blockchain protocols, and every node must follow them. This makes blockchains censorship-resistant and trustless systems, allowing users to transact without relying on a central authority. As long as most nodes remain honest, Dan doesn't have to worry about blockchain security.